Hi students, in this video I'm going to show you how to create your mini lectures on your laptop. So if you're at home and you want to use your laptop instead of your smartphone, uh, this video is for you. You can see you've got three worksheets. Uh, worksheet number one is for researching your painting. So you're going to go to the websites I showed you and research your painting and this is where you write all of your notes. You don't need to write full sentences, just notes. The second worksheet is to create your mini lecture support. And the support is the worksheet you will use when creating your flip. So here I've printed out my support and I'm going to use these keywords when I'm talking about my video. So you just go back to your notes, choose the most important words, and you write them here. In your support and then you use only your support to create your video and the third worksheet that you have which you're going to use next week is watching your video your partner's video and taking notes so each student you all have a partner you're going to watch their video and then practice listening to a lecture and you're going to practice taking notes by completing this worksheet so how do you make a flip grid to make your flip, you go to the website and you can enter your code, the code I sent you on Google Classroom, and then you just log in with Google. It's quite simple. Here uh, is the information about this week's mini lecture. To record your response, you just click this button. I'll have to turn my camera off here. And now this is the video for Flipgrid. Uh, there's a few options here. We don't need to use any of them this week, so we're not going to. Uh, I'm not going to talk about that. Uh, the only one we're going to use this week is here, which is photo. So you're going to add a picture of your painting. Uh, in addition, I want to explain this option very quickly. Uh, this is a great feature. It's a sticky note, and inside the sticky note, you could, if you wanted to, add your keywords. So if I was going to do this, I would put my keywords here, uh, Johannes Vermeer, he painted it in 1665, um, and it's a portrait. So you could, if you want to, put all your keywords in your sticky note, and then use your sticky note as your support. Alternatively, print this out and use it, it's up to you. The choice is, is yours. Uh, when you're ready to record, you push this button and you can record your flip. Now, for our mini lectures, I recommend recording your lecture in three parts. Part one will be your introduction, a very simple introduction. Part two will be your mini lecture talking about your painting. And part three will be a very simple and easy conclusion. So let's start with the introduction. Good morning. Today I'm going to talk about girl with a pearl earring. So I go to next and I'm going to edit this video very quickly. So I'm going to clip this here. Okay. Confirm. Now I want to add more. I want to add a second video. So I'm going to actually add my conclusion right now. Thank you for listening. Do you have any questions? So I'm going to click this again. And I'm happy with that. Confirm. So now I've got my introduction and my conclusion. I'm going to add more and I'm going to record my mini lecture. So to do that, you need to find a picture of your painting. Here's a picture of my painting. Well, I didn't paint it, but the painting I'm going to talk about, Girl with a Pearl Earring. Um, 
If you want to, you can record with yourself on the screen and the picture next to you. Alternatively, you can make the, pic the painting bigger so that it covers the whole screen. This is much, much, much easier to do on your smartphone. So here is one difference between your laptop and your smartphone. It's easier to do on your smartphone doing this uh, picture. So if you want to, my recommendation is to use your smartphone, but it's your choice. Uh, so here is my mini lecture about girl with a pearl earring. I'm going to use my support. I'm going to use the keywords and I'm going to talk about this painting. Girl with a Pearl Earring was painted by Johannes Vermeer in 1665. Uh, it's a portrait, which means it's a painting of a person, and it shows uh, a young girl against a dark background, and she's looking out at the audience or at the viewer. She's wearing a turban, a blue turban, and in her left ear she has a large pearl earring. So who was Johannes Vermeer. He was a Dutch painter and he was referred to or called the master of light. He was very good at showing light in his paintings and how light and reproducing the effects of light in his art. So you keep talking and when you're finished your recording you can just go to next and you've got your introduction you can move your conclusion here. So I'm happy with that. And then finally I click next and I put in my name. Make sure you put in your full name, first name, and then family name. And you can take a selfie. Interesting. Uh, didn't know that happened. Okay, here we go. There's my selfie. Submit. And now there is my video and it's finished. You can now go to Flipgrid and watch your partner's video and take notes and evaluate their lecture too. So that's how to do, that's how to create a, a video using Flip and how to create your mini lecture. Uh, I hope you have fun making your lecture and if you have any questions you can ask me in class on Monday or Tuesday. Best of luck and I'm looking forward to watching your videos. Enjoy your weekend.